hello. Patricia. Mariah. P. M. And together we are PM Artist Studio. Man, we have quite the crew already. Fourteen of you. Whoa. In fact, yeah. I'm gonna pop out my chat. I'm gonna say hello to everybody. We've got Ann, Brad, Christy, Cookie Wookie, C. W. Brown, Darcy, Eva, Gail. Hello, Gail. You're new. Kristen C. Lee's Art Studio. We have PM Artist Studio. Panka Violet. <laughs> Somebody else snuck in there. Heather. Hello. Hello. Heather. Oh, and Lee Ann. Hello. Awesome, guys. I'm so excited you're all here. I think there was another new name there, but it didn't come up on the little list. That was interesting. Sometime. Angela. Are you still here, Angela? There we go. All right. Um, what are we doing today? Today. Don't, don't be shy, Angela. <laughs> she, she's from Canada. Um, mm -hmm. What are we doing today? We're experimenting with stencils because... We've got some things. Fran, where's Fran? Violet, where's Fran? Yeah, yeah Dad, I, it. I've been working all morning trying to <laughs> fix you up here. Yeah, we're trying to get some Fran. Things. The least you can do is show up. Yeah, <laughs> although I, I know it is kind of late and weird and whatever. It but. is there. So three, it's like nine or ten o'clock. Mo, what time is it there? Let us know. Mo's here too. Did I say that in the chat? Yes, she did. Okay. See, I try to read it fast because it changes on me. My little yeah, I, I, it, glit, it moves and then my eyeballs oh, say, what? oh my goodness, what yeah. was that? What was that? What's what was that? What, 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 what? Um, are you ready for me to go topside? I am. Okay, awesome. I'm, I'm prepared. I love it. Um, well, I say that. So, there was much, well, not, I mean, Fra Fran was very excited about Pea's Frankenstencils. She usually is. Hey, Lisa. Oh, so glad you're here. And Gretchen, welcome, welcome to you guys. Um, Hold on, I'm switching cameras here. I'm, I'm sort of multitasking, but it ain't going well. There we go. All right. That doesn't seem like it's lined up with the other one. This one's there off. I, I ha I'm not centered up here, so don't. Well, I was moving you. Oh, you like... mean me? Yeah, you, I didn't know if you were lined up with me. This looks uh, weird. Yeah. I don't know what to tell you. I'm not. There. Make sure I'm lined up. <laughs> yeah, it's it's important to be lined up. Oh, now I got you. Like two. There we go. Cool. All right, perfect. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, hello, Mary Ellen Weber. Hello, hello, and Fiona. Okay, she's good for thirty-five minutes. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Carolyn is. She's doing oh. laundry. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so what we have out here is sort of a timeline, an <laughs> evolution of stencil. And then kind of back again and then explode it again. Yeah. I'm still missing some of the the the, the links. <laughs> the oh. links in the chain. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. It definitely separated at certain points and um well, I don't think it was worthy of keeping. Yeah. Because it kind of just disintegrated. Well, yeah. Well, one of our things was just like, oh, I can't imagine that, you know. Who who would want, want this? Because it this. looks kind of weird. And, you know, we hadn't met a lot of you guys yet. Yeah. <laughs> I, liked, it yet. I, I liked it. But, you know, we were afraid that the. The, the, others would not. Others, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And that's like, what pretty, do pretty that? much been the way it is, except for Fran. <laughs> yeah. God love her. Yeah, she she definitely keys in on the the, the lovely weirdnesses. And Mo, Mo 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 appreciates some of our weirdnesses as well. Actually, yeah. mainly your weirdnesses, because I'm usually the one going. I don't know about that. I, I don't know. If people know like why. I'm gonna <laughs> show. What? I'm gonna show you how how to do this. I've got it all lined up underneath this other thing. So this is you know Franken stenciling 101. Yeah, this is it. Now this is really cool because hey, I don't remember. I don't. This is the stencil. This is the new version. Well, it's the same version as this one. It's just bigger. Bigger. Which eventually I'll go down to. If we yeah, put so these in now the shop, got... I will make the little five. Like you can tell, that was. It was so early in our stencil. Yeah, that this isn't even Yupo. This it's is that some mylar other... business that I can't stand. Like I was like, if we're using this, this is not going to do. 
yeah. It, and um, I'm, I'm really afraid to wash it. I, I may have to send this one off to John David and just like consider chop it up and do things. Chop it up and mm -hmm. make it into something else because I don't. You know, some of this stuff actually dissolves. And in, likes the stencil too. Well, yeah, you know. You, yeah. you guys that are here in the chat, I think most of you are, are like, you're our people. You understand us and, and have similar loves and, and weirdnesses and things. And that that's okay. No, we I, just weren't sure no, <laughs> when no. we were starting this. <laughs> well, all we saw was really cute stuff. Yeah. And I, that's one of the reasons that we started doing this. Started doing makers was because I told Mariah, I said, you know, if I, I see one more cute thing, I'm just going to bomb it. But then she spends, you know, how, how long has she been working with them butterflies? <laughs> I know. I told you, just, hey, just my, give her time. Just give her time my, and the right thing. And my she'll... butterflies are not... Hello, Natalia, and hello, Christy. Cutesy, cutesy. All right. Well, if you guys are loving on this, then I will put it in the shop. And then we'll send you the pieces and parts and everything. So I know. And you see, can string it together like paint. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, you can't see it here. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't have a big I was like, look at this. I don't think we even kept. Well, the other sheets that we used weren't this big. So we probably, it probably didn't even register in our brains. This is probably true. Yeah. There you go. This is, but look at that edge there. Oh, I'm going to do something so cool with that. Lisa's, Lisa Mingus says, we get your stuff. Hello, Lisa Mingus. I'm glad you're here. And here are all these little pieces. Now, the other, I did actually save these, Mariah. Because remember, I made that thing that I put into the, yes. the scary book. Mm -hmm. That lost us subscribers. Yeah. There's a, like a noticeable dip when we did our spooky <laughs> stuff. Our subscribers went poop. I'm like, well, that's interesting. <laughs> all right. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 it didn't hurt my feelings at all. No, like, I, I didn't have to worry about it. Yeah, I'm like, well, it's probably not going to be the last time we do some <clears throat> scary stuff, so that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't that scary. It was not that scary. Spooky. Yeah. Okay. Hey, Diana. I'm all right. glad you're here. So here we are. I'm, I am not going to, I'm just going to just give you my little tips and Tips and tricks. Tips and ti tips. <laughs> She's not going to give you those. <laughs> well, I don't really have any. It's a spare. <laughs> um, anyway. Uh, okay, so I was looking for the tape that doesn't tape. And I couldn't find it. But AKA I, I, washi. I found my... <laughs> now that stuff sticks. Medical, medical tape. I think it sticks a little better. Uh, yeah, it does. I may have a little bit of difficulty. Mm -hmm. But you want to... To line your thing up and then tape the top and the bottom. Hello, Pascal. Because if you do that, then when you go through here. And Christina, hello. I'm just going to do one of these. I'm, that's all I'm doing. Like you guys get the idea. So you get the idea. You get your string across there. Now, and uh, give yourself a little bit of extra. And you're using the art glitter glue for this? Yeah. I'll tell you, that, what, I'll tell you what. What happened to that stencil? There's only one place that it kind of pulled loose, and that was because I yanked it. But what was very interesting is, can you see these little dots here? Okay, that's where the... I'm going to zoom in. And then can you put the black yeah. or a white? Because, you know, you got kind of pattern over pattern. And I'm even struggling. <laughs> gotcha. I, I really hate when people do that, too. Okay, so you can see the little dots of glue. Well, those started showing up in, in the prints, and I'm going, where... It's that little nail head thing coming from. Oh, I remember that. Remember that? Because, see, this string was going across here, and then it, I don't know, went down there or whatever. But anyway, it busted loose, so I had to redo it, and then these little dots just stayed on there. And I thought they were kind of cool. So if you have little dots of glue that's still on there, no, no worries. It, it sort of adds to the... <laughs> adds to the design. Adds to the design. There you go. Yeah. Okay, so what I'm doing here is I'm gluing every other one. I'm not gluing down to that middle thing because that's what I hold it with to get the next one. You'll see what I mean here. I can't talk now because I have glue in my mouth. And you got your pen in. Okay. Don't go clear out to the edge because remember if you glue this down to your table here. <laughs> that was funny, Violet. You're not gonna have, you're not gonna be happy. 
smash it down go on to the next one and use your other little tool because every time I use my dead gum finger yeah it gets stuck mm -hmm. yeah the string gets stuck to your finger instead of where they need to be so another little great use of the um, little silicone stylus business and remember we have some of those in our um, 3,000 subscriber giveaway and by the way while you guys are here just give us the thumbsy up seats so that lets everybody know hey something cool's gonna happen and over here if you're watching the replay please do the same it also lets people know hey something cool happened over here <laughs> um, you might want to check, it, check out. it out as well uh, please like subscribe and do all that business ring the bell it then notifies you when we do stuff hopefully if youtube is doing that sort of thing there you go that's really painful for me. I don't even know if blue's going out there. I just have to wait until the light hits it. Because it's white on white. I need to make some kind of glue that's cool. Well, you could add a little color to it. Kind of like the spackle that's pink. And then it dries white. Hmm. Yeah. They need something like that. And as you can see, these are not lining up perfectly. Which I'm really kind of happy about that. Yeah. It makes it more interesting. Oh, this is cotton string. It's the kind that you tie up your roast beef or turkey. Oh yes, Natalia. Oh, she's in a she's in a refugee camp in in Poland right now, watching us. Well, I'm glad that you. She says so. Getting over to Facebook is tricky. It's hard enough just getting on the uh, on the internet. So, oh yeah. Well, wow. thank you. Yeah. I mean, we definitely feel privileged for that. Yes, we do, and I, I have a, I have my Ukraine shirt. If I'd known you were going to be here today, I would have wore it in your honor. Well, she probably needs to wash it. No, I did wash it. Oh. Washed it on gentle. All right, now, does anyone need for me to do the rest of this? Just holler out and let me know. Are you guys riveted by this? Do, do, you, do you get the idea of how to string your pieces together? So I will have this one in the shop this week soon maybe this afternoon i don't know there's another because like i said so fran wanted like all four pieces so there's <laughs> see these are the inner bits okay. off of the actual stencil so yeah if you'll Let, show that I'm now i'm gonna get them back here okay so you get the innards this yes. is the innards of style oh. we'll call this one style one yeah this is the old one. You don't get that one. Well. Unless I guess you. There might be a version of that. This hey, is Deb. This is the innards of the outside innards. Yeah. Okay. This. Mm -hmm. Now. These. Are going to be in the shop. Because I had to paint them black. Yeah. Yeah. I highly recommend before you start stenciling, make yourself a texture plate. Yes. Because it's a lot better to do it now. That texture paste sticks to your painted surfaces and it's very difficult mm -hmm. to get off. And then there's this. Yeah. Hey, Diana. And Diana. I, you know, I Sorry. just, sometimes I really like the one that has the edge on it. Mm hmm. And then sometimes I just don't. Yeah. So, you know. So that's what we're going to be working on today to finish up to get these into the shop are the ones that she made those prints from because yeah. I don't have those original files so I was like um can you paint them black and then we'll kind of <laughs> rework Rever that reverse yeah, engineer it. reverse it <laughs> and I don't know that I'm going to make them big big in fact what I may do is just make them a set that comes you know like it's a one sheet kind of thing so you'll get the parts top and the bottom and the parts yeah well, I think and that, just be done with that. <laughs> that that would be, I think, really, yeah. 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 Um, the glue is the art glitter glue. Yeah. It does not actually have glitter. And I'm telling you what, this is a workhorse. It that stencil, like I said, it, it's had a lot of use. You can tell how thick it and is. And it's over a year because, like, it, we were talking oh, about. Oh yeah. Because this was what, some of the very first ones. Hello, Sarah. I I need to email you, Sarah. Something came back. Yeah. Oh, New Zealand. Yeah. Well, we're really happy when all of this. I know. It, it was rocking there for a bit, and then all of a sudden. Oh, Fran's here. All right. Well, Fran, we're you just missed. 
everything that we talked about <laughs> was for your benefit. Did I miss? Did I miss anything? <laughs> yeah. Okay. You're just gonna have to watch the rerun, sweetheart. Yeah. You got you to come back to the beginning because we did talk about all of that business, and then I have some other parts, and um, we will. Uh, I will get you all of the parts because I'm working with Fran on this a bit. Yeah, because she's just getting files. Or, yeah, I mean, she's she's, she's, she's one just... of the few that I would actually because I trust her and know what she's gonna do with them. Yeah. Yeah. We know where just she lives. Honest. You're that friend. Yeah. Come find you. <laughs> she, she, she hasn't done anything nefarious with them so far. So <laughs> most of the time, she just prints them or cuts them and you know, okay. talks about us on her live stream. So <laughs> I wanted to show you my latest brayer removal here, which um, why do you keep it, just, these? Things? I do not know, but you know what? I'm not even going to bother. I'm just going to go ahead and use this one. It'll probably have a little bit of a impression there for a while but eh, I don't know. think it's going to be anything I, I'm, I soaked the other one off mm -hmm. and I had to take a the nail scrubby brush yeah, and scrub it even with the Murphys? even with Murphys and that was after three days and three just, days with Murphy three mm -hmm. days of Murphys and here you can still see it's got some it's still got some little staining it's that metallic man Oh, well, I don't know that that was a metallic there. That was, I don't know what that was. But anyway, it was kind of green. Hmm. See, you can see a little residue there. But I'm I'm not even going to worry about this one. I'm just going to go ahead and use it and see if it works. Oh, um, Kelly, you can get it on you know Amazon. And this is the time of year to actually order it because they don't ship it during the winter. Cause it fr if it freezes, it, it, it messes working. it up. Yeah. It doesn't work any longer. Okay, well, if I need that, I've got it up there. But right now, I'm using another one that's... I, I had to clean this one off because I want you to look at that goo on the end. It wasn't turning. <laughs> that is... Some, going, oh, that, that's oh, thick. Oh. Yeah, that's when you know you need to clean your brayer. Okay, well, got another skin there. Now, what? Um... I want to bring this back because I've had That's this. That's right. Mr. Clean's Here. girl, Mrs. Murphy, is, sla is slacking. <laughs> she was. Yeah. And, and if you. There he was. I'm telling you what, the best <laughs> dead gum stuff is that Axe body wash. Oh, who was it? Somebody got some at the dog. Sandy, dog I think. Yeah. At the Christmas shop. <laughs> and she said, yes, it smells horrible. <laughs> But she might clean it. Use Delta cleaner toilets. <laughs> I'm telling you what, it doesn't take off the porcelain, but it's, it does remove paint. <laughs> and it's got some, some yeah. smells. <laughs> okay, I'm going to read you my note here. <laughs> Go into your restroom, going. It smells like a glove up in here. Who's been there? You had to have somebody else showering in our house. Because you can honestly, I can smell it coming up the stairs uh -huh. when it's used in the bathroom. Yes. Body wash is just weird. I know. It I'm is, here yeah. for weird suggestions, weird stencils. Okay, I, I, I have <laughs> all I the have, weird. I have my note up here that Judy P sent me that says, "Write it down." It's <laughs> right up there. I've got it. Word. Write it down. So I wrote it down, and it's been sitting over here uh, at oh, least for two weeks. Mm -hmm. It says, "So I want to preserve, keep the violet on the butterflies." But yellow out, brown, the indistinct ones, uh, especially the ones on the top right corner. This I want to you know, remove that because I don't really think it adds anything. And you've got that straight line. I don't know how that happened. But anyway, I, I think we can work around it. So what I was thinking was. Hello, Kylie. I'm going to put the butterfly down. This one. Right. It, it, the same butterfly to same, hold the... Oh my gosh, and I hope I can find that butterfly. I know I can find it. I just have to find well, the same one. luckily we have some extras down there and I know where they're at. So if all else fails, I'll... I think, I can, I think mine are in here. It says, okay. mask out the butterfly at the bottom, put it down, and then put the plate on top. Because remember how we work with alignment there? Oh, here. So we're getting some questions regarding the Frankenstenciling. So hold on. Okay. All right, what if you arrange shapes in a circle or spiral, then glued the string in a spiral, then add one or two horizontal strings just to connect? Yeah. Yeah. In fact, she made a fish. 
I got Where's a fish, fish somewhere on that cart over there. Yeah, I wish I would have dug the fish out. The fish is fantastic. And this was also still when we were messing yeah. around with that stupid mylar business. Yeah, and, and, and let me tell now you, that glue, I have a big plate. The glue works way better on the Yupo. Oh, yeah, it does. Because it's not so slicky. I would say, actually, if you're, if you're Franken-stenciling your stencils that you already have, you're chopping them up, um, I would recommend maybe lightly sanding that mylar ever so bit. Unless, of course, you have paint buildup on it. Then I think that's fine. And then you can yeah, it, it'll, it'll, use your it'll, string. It'll grab. Yeah. I, that's a good idea. Just take, you Fran know, wants your little to see the fish. Emery, emery board. What? <laughs> Fran wants to see the fish. <laughs> Fran, we have to dig it out. It's when we redid the that card over there. Is it in the texture box? Oh. I'm going to look down. If it's in the texture box, you get to see the fish. Uno momento. Yeah. Otherwise, you don't. Yeah. Okay. So, that's what I'm going to do with that. Then I've got this one, which really, you know, initially, I really liked this. I didn't want to do anything with it. But I'm over that now. <laughs> that happens. A lot. A lot. This one, I really love these two butterflies that this blown out corner over here I'm just I'm, I'm not loving that and I don't know what to do about it so if you don't know what to do to make it better and it's something you really like well play around on something that isn't so precious and come back to it that's my my feeling I don't know yet and then this one I think could just be more interesting and I think this one could be more interesting I really like this one but I think it needs a little oomph of something but look at those little those little antenna there oh did you hear all that talk about oomph to or see the, the comments i just warmed my heart number one wendy was what wendy was at michael's yesterday and michael's i guess was having a sale or whatever and then so she was asking the group what color she should get and what kind and then um she had purchased her stuff and then susan had some great information about how, you know, she used mainly fluids or uh, fluid acrylic or the high flow. can't remember exactly. I think it was high flow. I kept talking about fluids, but kind of, you know, in the same category there. They both dry very quickly. Yes. Yes. Um, and then Mo, she came in. She did a comparison, did the photos. I mean, just rocking. That, just, that stuff in Makers makes me just... Oh, I, I mean, you have no idea. Like it, it warms my heart. This is, this this is what makes what we do um, worthwhile. Is when it's when you see it show up. Oh, Angela wants to know: Do we have tutorials on making texture plates? Um, we we have a video, don't we? Mm, I can't remember. If we ever actually showed the making. I think we did. It was very quick because the thing is, is like all it is is using light and fluffy and we highly recommend light and fluffy, which is the crafters workshop texture paste. The reason we like it is it is light and fluffy. It dries quickly and it has lots of loft to it. Yes. Well worth and it really ultimately speaking, I don't think that price wise It's about a dollar more than the cheap stuff and it's Or even some of the more expensive stuff yeah, like the golden I value there. And we did we made a comparison thing. I remember it now. Well, yes, with all of that. But then all you do is use the texture paste through your stencil before you start using on your stencil. Cardboard. Um let's see. Uh Robin did it on cereal boxes, I think. Yeah, it was. and I almost think it's Might better be to have something a little bit flexible. Yeah. Because a lot of times I get that squared off edge from Hello, the hard Rhonda. Because the cardstock that we have it on is really thick. And I don't necessarily like that. Anne says, yes, there was a live about making texture plates. There you go. Anne was probably there. I, I, oh, I, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I thought we did it. But, you know, there's a lot of times when I think something. and yeah. yeah, and Angela, if you reach out to me, you can either do it on Facebook or, e you know, our email is attached to, um, if you come back to, like, the main profile on our channel, you can email me, and I'll get you a list of exactly which ones. But just reach out to me, Facebook, Instagram, whatever your preferred method. Um, just do that, and, and I will get you what you need and get you the videos. It's really, it, it's a very simple process. There are are a few little tricks, and I highly recommend you use 
the store cards, credit cards, plastic. Yeah, they work really well. They work a lot better than your palette knife. Hello, paper lace. Okay, I love this print. I know I've showed you this print before, but I love this print. To me, it has so much movement and so much rich I... texture. I wouldn't change this. No. This is a done print. Even though there are some areas that I'm not in love now, with. You know what would be awesome? Is if I did the spatter with gold. I'll think, think about that. that was, I don't know that, that I, I would I take it next level. It, it might. It might. Okay, we're going to start off with this thing because I know what I want to do. I've already figured, I've already thought it through. And I don't know what I'm going to do on these others, so we'll just put those back over there. Okay, now to find my butterfly, let me just show Oh, you. now you should show her one of the texture plates. Because she uh -huh. never, we call them impression plates or texture plates. Um, I mean, people, we certainly didn't like invent it by any means. We just made oh, it no. better. No. Oh, <laughs> here, here, speaking of, here's, a, here's our web, Mariah's web. I love this one. And this really looks. I'll. I'll we'll. We'll do it because it. It. It's a very unassuming. And the thing I like about it is it can be so many yes. different things. And the really cool thing that you can do with the web, and we found this out during the spooky talk because this was you know part of the spooky characters kind of set and everything. But um, when you use the what was it the the little glass beads. Oh, and it looked like it had been embroidered. It had that that really thick stitch look to it. It was so cool. It really was. I did not find the fish, so we will dig out the fish, and I'll probably just keep reminding me or, or send me a, a a message, a private message, friend, and I will get it out of the file bin because I think that's where it is. If it wasn't in the texture box. Butterflies. Yeah. Oh, the blue with the brown butterfly almost looked like ginkgo leaves. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. Friend said. I guess I could pull the box over here and dig through the box while P's doing things. <laughs> well, I don't see why not. You're not doing anything. I'm not else. doing anything. <laughs> I say that up to her all the time. It's, it's not true. It's not. I think that's we, it. Do, do you kind of have a clue as to, like, but it is in the, it's in those files, right? That's what we're feeling. What? The fish. I have no earthly idea what happened to the fish. It, it disappeared in, during one of your Napoleonic <laughs> cleaning sessions. <laughs> and, you know, okay. and I didn't really care about it anyway, so I was like, I don't care. I don't it needs work, and, and you know, I didn't love it. Yeah. It's, it's, it's just. I'm, I'm going to dig through this one. I actually think it might be in this one rather than over there. So. All right, now this part is really important because if you want that to match up, you're going to have to put it on in the same spot. And that just, re oh, you moved, you booger. Oh, well, I don't think it's enough. I was afraid you were going to drop it. <laughs> what? Nothing. All right, so now let's see. If we line it up, and the thing is, eh, it's off. Can you see the wing? Mm. Is that it? Is it in there? I don't know yet. I'm just kind of, you know... Fumbling around. <laughs> You're not being very nice to me today. Um, I found your other, like the um, more mass-produced texture plate. What does that mean? You know, like the plastic one. The for rubbing. Oh yeah. You can go to you can go to cemeteries and do rubbings on tombstones. That's really cool. Was sort of random, but it is true. Frotage. Frotage. Rub up against your <laughs> local cemetery. Cemeteries. 
Yes. Okay. Yeah. Alrighty. Alright, now that's my mask. So what do I want to use for my color? Well, I definitely want to use something transparent because I do want some of the I want the other lines to show through and be suggestive. I don't want to obliterate them. But I still want this purple to show. So what do we do? What do we do? Oh, Lee bought some um they they call it uh the the brand I think there is Perspex. Uh, like the acrylic plates. I, I tell you, it's a game changer. Oh, it is. I mean, you, you've just opened up, wow, lots of other stuff. Now, this is transparent, you can see. So when it goes over the other stuff here, the other color stuff, this is all, and my only concern is that corner is going to become bright blue yeah and, and flare up and flare up even more mm -hmm. so i'm not sure that that's a good candidate and fran says you need a butterfly solid a solid one tell brad <laughs> <laughs> although that would be pretty easy to do like you just fill it in and you know cut it out yeah that would be yes a mask fran you're absolutely right a full on to do this to do this kind of stuff that I'm doing right now, to mask out that butterfly, keep it in exactly the... Let me tell you, those little boogers would be a lot easier to pick off the plate. So, I mean, I'm all for it. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. All it's right. Not in there that I could tell from the quick search. Quick search. Yes. Let's use some... How about Indian yellow? And what I will do is I will deal with that corner afterwards if I need to. Everybody in agreement on that? I don't know because I'm looking for a darn fish. I've been saving my burgers. <laughs> I noticed Fran, Fran, Fran has more burgers than I have. I think she's been collecting them longer. I just never knew that, you know, these were going to be an issue. I just know that they can be an issue on the... Oh, my goodness. I don't know if that's a booger or if that's just a thin some old film. Stuff here. Uh, okay. Enough with the boogers. That's probably way too much. But I don't want to have to redo my paint. Yeah, I don't know where that darn fish went. We're just going to have to do some serious, like, got to pull that stuff out. You know. Do the stuff. Okay. Let's see here. The, the sticker that P had on her paint... To see the transparent, yes. Thanks, Mo. Yes, those are our little swatch things. And I've thought about putting the actual stickers in the shop. If you wanted to buy, like, pre-printed, laser-printed stickers. The circle ones that are on the top of our little paint pots. Let me know about that, guys. Uh, Panka wants to know what we, you make with the boogers. We don't know yet. No, we don't. I mean, it would be kind of funny, like, if you could... If she saves up enough of them, we can make a cool little journal cover, book cover, artist book. <laughs> Your hat and the, the the web stencil or texture plate looks really cool together. Really? Yeah. Well, I don't know if I love that. Oh, hey, Ricky. Yes, hello. Welcome. Well, you're not that late. I mean, we just kind of got started. Yeah. There was a conversation about how to, you know. Well, now see, this is kind of, this together. this is interesting because it kind of creates that what do you call that a ray oh, of sunshine it, into the. Eva calls them paint rings. Paint rings. Mm -hmm. And Anne said that is a much classier name. Yes, it is. We're <laughs> saving our paint rings. Mm -hmm. 
We don't know for what, but we're going to save them anyway. Yes. All right. Well, I'm not in love with this yet, but I will be. And I can't do anything else to it because it's extremely wet. I used a whole lot of paint. I, and I don't know what to do with that poor little butterfly. I just got the boogers unstuck stuck the other day. I got them and they were just like this. And when you're pulling them apart, you're going, oh, I hope I don't lose a little wing. All right, here. Uh -huh. Now, we had some discussion. I'm glad we're doing this because Fran was in on this one, too. Here is the original cheddar. And I told Mariah, I am, she's not paying me for advertising, so I am not mentioning. And well, I don't neither know is to... Amsterdam or Golden. Well, that's true. But I just think her stuff is it's outrageously priced for what you get. Yeah. And the quality is not necessarily commensurate with the price. Yeah. Because I don't mind paying for something, but it better be good. And th this is. Okay, this is an old Windsor Newton, and it's called Finity. Benzamidazolone, say that really fast. <laughs> Two ounces, and it was old, was nine ninety eight. Now, that is in Alaska, so, you know, everything's more expensive there. Anyway, the tube was getting ooky, so I got it out. Now, I want to show you here. This will be great because I'm hoping this gel plate is sticky enough that it's going to keep those guys from rolling around. Hello, Vanessa. And it's hello, really, Estella. can you see that, Mariah? Yes. It's in between these two. Like, it's kind of browned out a little. Well, that's what I'm going to show you. The little do. trick to browning out your... Or dulling out. Dulling out your colors. Because this color here is going to become cheddar. Can you see in here? Okay, even, I'm starting with my light color. And I noticed that there's some red in there already that hasn't been smooshed around. I don't know how that happened. <laughs> Talk to your mixer. <laughs> yeah, really, I, I would love to talk to my mixer, but I think I am. Okay, so we got a little red down there. Let's mix that around because what I notice is that I think that this particular has more red in it than other things. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and it also has more yellow. So I think that we've got the orange where we need the orange. Now we need to get the rest of it up to speed. And what I should do is take a little bit of this. <laughs> what? Fran, we're already kind of, um, <coughs> kind of choked me up there. It's like, <laughs> what? <coughs> Fran says, write down the recipe. Fran, you just watch. Okay. I have no idea. This is just. I was going to say, the thing is, is like, we don't know what the beginning pot is. <laughs> And I, see, this is the other thing that I really, you know, you think this little nozzly thing is going to be just absolutely no, it's, it's annoying. wonderful. It's, it's annoying as crap. And <coughs> it no come outy. I'm trying to get some out here so I can do a swatch. And I don't know, I may not have that much in here. Well, oh, that's a, my big gripe about the little nozzle like that because you're, you're trying to get it out and then all of a sudden you, you smack it and then it blurps and you know yeah that and was... you guys know about this this stuff right oh well, that's oh and then um vanessa thank you she said that she would be interested in those so i'll try to maybe get those up in the shop soon these little hummers mm -hmm. yeah that you can buy like we'll print them and cut them because it is nice to have them laser printed because then it doesn't You don't have to out. worry about it altering the, yeah. um... Okay, there's cheddar. And you can see, it's it's fairly opaque. And I think she does make others that aren't opaque. Probably. But that's all I know. Hello, Nettie! Yeah. Okay, so Mariah mentioned something. She said, it, we need to dull it down a bit. S we have options. And we talked about, this is called fluid acrylic, and this is called high flow. Okay, see right there, high flow. Sorry about all the paint all over it. Um, <laughs> that happens, I'm messy. Mm -hmm. She is. And you can't even read turquoise here because it's... Yeah, those are not the same color. No, they're not. I'm just showing you the 
the fluid acrylics will have have little things in them that shake. Can you hear it? Starting to. <laughs> yeah. Well, you want to hear those little things before you start pouring Knocking this out. out. Yeah. Because what happens is that paint separates in there. I don't know about this stuff. This seems to be okay. Now, I'm just going with this because I know that. Oh, my goodness. Look at that one. Ha. I might have to employ a instrument here to get my. Oh, Carolyn bought some of the, um, I think some of the Dinah Wakely stuff, but but she got forty percent off. That's good because that stuff's pricey. That is, and and you really um, you can do better elsewhere unless it's on sale. Or are you talking about the golden paints? That's a really great deal. If you got forty percent off of the golden stuff because they, they, although hey, Mo did a enabler alert for those of you that are I think in the UK. Well, actually, for the UK, I don't know if beyond. <laughs> okay, did you see that tiny little <clears throat> drop of blue that I added there? And what happened here? Of course, now, the thing with the Goldens is they're highly pigmented. Mm -hmm. you, you, you're not dealing with a, a craft. And this would be a lot better if I were mixing it in a dish. Or how like Fran does like, or like add on Fran the, does add properly, on the thing, but you know, you know and smush it in there. It, it's already in the jar, and I'm I'm yeah. sorry, I apologize. I'm trying to keep it in camera. Now Leanne says, "Oh, that toned it down really quick." Yeah, it did. It did. One tiny little drop. But see, that's the that's one of the reasons that those fluids or the because you use right the fluid or mm -hmm. the high flow. Those two just make me, I don't know why my brain just doesn't wrap around that. But anyway, um, that's why they're more expensive. They're very pigmented. Yes. Highly pigmented. There we go. Highly pigmented. <clears throat> okay, I'm trying to get one of these, of course. <laughs> because this is what I do here. I've got my little my little swatch here. Oh, look at that. <laughs> that's funny, Lisa. All right, so that's this is what we this is where we're going. And let's see if we're getting there. And you're still pretty bright. I think you need more yellow. I think I need more yellow too. I agree with that. I think we're. I think value wise, or mm -hmm. you know, you uh, toned it down. Toned it down. Now you're trying to just color. Now I'm trying to just yeah, match the color. And I think what we're gonna do. <sighs> oh, Darcy said she looked up one time about tinting paint color for her walls, and golden fluid was recommended. Well, yeah, I bet. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add some nickel azo. Hello, Susan. We were talking about you earlier. <laughs> it's it's a little bit of a green yellow. That and I think that that's not going to hurt mm -mm, anything. That might be just. The I thing. want to add one, two, three, four. Yeah. Any reason? No. Just felt good. Yeah. Four just felt like. See, it was the see right. what it looks like in there. Uh huh. Fran. Fran would like a swatch of ch the actual cheddar. Oh, we'll send it to you then the next yeah. missive. Well, we'll send you a little swatch of all the ones that we've made. Or, well, the cheddar, and then we'll send you a little swatch page. Okay. Now, hey. I'm going to put this over here. That's looking pretty good there, P. Still a little bright. Still a little bit bright. I think a tiny, oh, and this is where it gets really tricky. Because I just need such a tiny, tiny little bit of this. And maybe a little bit more, just sure? regular yellow. Yeah, I still feel like it needs a little bump in the yellow. I think you should add the yellow first. <clears throat> you think I should add the yellow first? Mm hmm Okay. Regular yellow. Yeah. Feeling good about that. One little squeeze. A little dabble, do ya? All right. Well, that was more like a... That was a long squeeze, not a short squeeze. That was squeeze. kind of a goose turd size. <laughs> there you go. That, there you go. That's the measure. Run, out, run out and check your farmyard animals. 
<laughs> excrement. <laughs> goodness. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, goodness, goodness. And the other thing that you have to realize is that this, this is heavy body. That's fluid. And you don't want to leave this in here because the other day I left it in there and I whacked it and it went rolling across the I have a little hoopty do thing that holds stuff like that. I, I just, I don't, I'm not sure oh, where it is. Oh, looky that we're getting mighty close. Mighty. Mighty close. I think it needs a little bit more yellow. Maybe a tad of white. <laughs> because remember, yeah. this is opaque. We don't care. That might, yeah, that might be the thing too to. Because I do <laughs> think it needs to be slightly lighter. Mm-hmm. All right, we're gonna do it. Hello, Leslie. And for those of you that don't know, that this is sometimes kind of difficult to get her to actually add white or black to something. Well, if I want it to be transparent, then there's no sense in that. Yeah. Just none whatsoever. Uh, Gail would like to know why are we trying to get just the right orange? <laughs> we are recreating the cheddar. Because I want I, I want you to she know you don't have to pay designer color Price. prices. That's my whole thing. I mean, you know, I, I know I kind of upset the paper artsy people when I said, you know, I'm encouraging people to make your paint colors. Yeah. I'm just letting you know right up straight <clears throat> up there. Because I think your prices are 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 ridiculous. And, you know, she had her point. She says, you know, it's an Artisan paint, it's made in small batches. You're paying for shipping, yada, yada, boo-boo. And I'm just like, well, you know, that's all great, but doesn't change the price any. True that. The price is the same after you got through with all of that explanation. They are definitely not going to be asking us to do anything. At yeah. <laughs> and, and that ain't hurting my feelings any at all. i got better things to do anyway. <laughs> We're really holding out for Amsterdam and Golden. <laughs> All right, now, I am thinking this is very close, and you know what I think I'm going to add? I'm going to add some <clears throat> retarder. Hey, I'm proud of you. That That's that's some business right there. Now, I did take... Hey, Michelle! And I put the other paint swatch on the bottom of the jar... No. So that you can tell. <laughs> is, it, is it like a blizzard? You could probably hold it upside down. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I, I can't. It's not fluid. No. But I am going to make it a little bit more. Um, it's not going to be transparent. But I'm going to add a little bit more to this because I'm seeing there. And I think it's just because it's a fluid <laughs> acrylic as opposed to a heavy body. And, and says the word artisan. It's so overused. Artisan paint would be hand mixed just as P is doing right now. Rant over. Oh, for now. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we can just stop yes. and start calling this Ranty Tuesday. <laughs> enter yes. enter the chat at your own risk. <laughs> really? Maybe get Wait, more. What's everybody's little soapbox thing? <laughs> yes, everybody can come and soapbox their own. <laughs> Own stuff. Okay. Oh, and, and Mo says, uh, I join your rant with something about goose turd green. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Yes. That was we one really of need our, to mix that That was one. one of our colors because it was actually, you know. <clears throat> yeah, it's on the list from the, what, 1500s or something like that? Yeah. My favorite is the dead Spaniard. <laughs> I just, I'm like, really? That's so wrong. <laughs> are they all the same color? <laughs> I just don't they're think they're dead, I guess true. they are. Yeah. Like, that shouldn't be a standard. <laughs> well, I don't think it's a, it's a very accurate in, no. indicator. Because, you know. It's just completely So, how, how long has he been dead? Right. <laughs> what color was he before he died? A 10 day. I have so it's, many questions. It's a 10 day old. <laughs> yeah, you need to quantify this. Oh, gosh. <laughs> and what were the conditions in which he was lying? Oh, well, yeah, we, 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 we went through the whole hookers thing the other day. Now, that was Sunday's <laughs> discussion. Yes, we got all noted up on that. Yeah, we did. From the general to the all sorts of things. Yeah, there you go. 
Uh, yeah, Fran would also like to see goose turd green. All right, well, we have to look that up. Yeah, I don't know that I've made it. And, and then here's the dilemma. So even if we do find it on the internet, are we sure that that is... I, I mean, I guess we can say what, whatever we print out will be the goose turd green. Is everybody okay with that? Because you understand that like when I print things out from whatever source it is, it may or may not be even truly that color. I might be getting a little more, you know, technical than I need to be Needs about goose. a tiny bit more blue. You think? Yeah, because this is it right here. No, that's your I just No, I just put it down. Oh, again? Yeah. Well, let it dry. <sighs> it, I, I think you're splitting hairs at this point. It needs a tiny bit more. <laughs> Anne says that the goose turd might also vary based on goose's diet. This is very true. And Fran says she's okay with, yeah, us just kind of picking a, what we find. That may be more than you needed. Yep. Yeah. You need a little, I, and I don't have any more. I don't have any more Q-tips. Well. I'm all out. I think PM Artist Studio needs to be purchasing some I of do, those. I do. Because let me tell you, those little, the little pointed makeup Q-tip things are extremely handy. Okay. You see how much is in there? <clears throat> We're talking about. Okay, Michelle, can you can you post a picture of the goose turd? <laughs> but it's goose poop green. Is our, our, is the goose poop green that's on your dock? We we may be setting the standard <laughs> for what the goose poop's gonna be. Hey, that's actually pretty good. I mean, from what I can see from the paint on your stick. <laughs> Well, I have to get the same amount out there and r rub it around. Rub it around. Don't you roll. Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I know. She doesn't feel good. Oh. She got a cold. She saw them grandbabies. Hmm. And they probably had... Oh, the little germ bags? Little yes. germ bags. They are. They just pick Walking it up. Walking germ bags. Yeah. I swear. Oh, every Frances, time. she has pheasant poop. It's not the same. Goose is green. I, I I'm here to tell you. I have watched <clears throat> goose's goose poop, and it is. It's not. It's not as good as they. They're more of squirters. Rhinoceros. That's the one. She just finds it fascinating how rhinoceros versus rhinoceros poop. Okay. There you go. Need a tiny. <laughs> Tiny. Yeah, pheasant isn't green. I don't know. What <laughs> color is pheasant? I guess it depends on what kind of bugs they've been eating well, or that's grain. Well, kind of what or... Ann said, even about the goose. Well, this is true, too. And what is... If they've been eating grasshoppers, I mean, oh my goodness, yes. Okay, now see that? What's that saying? What, what's good for the goose? It's good for the gander? Yeah. I'm not sure that, that, that refers to their excrement. Well, they might be eating the same thing, or maybe they're well, not. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Was it good for both? <laughs> I, I don't know these things, Mariah. Yeah. <clears throat> well, I, I'm I'm pretty close to just saying, you know, calling it. Yeah, I wish you'd use that impression plate. Show show us how your 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 cheddar's working. I will. I think it's fantastic. Now, can you see all the way from over there? I, I, I'm going to kind of try to get it a little closer. Opacity. I think it will be just exactly the same if the opacity were the same. Because this is highly opaque. Which means it's got a lot of white in it. Yeah. And we're not going to put a whole lot of white, more white in. We're not going to put any more. I could put some... Um, oh, don't do that. No, 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 no. No. Oh. She has a special spot. Green gold. This is a good color. That might be goose poop. That might be. Okay. 
<laughs> All right, now we're going to look at this. Fran, I will send you this. I'm handing it to Mariah. I think she would like to know. We need to swatch it out and actually write the names on there. She can watch a video. She likes, she does that all the time and puts down the timestamp. Right, Fran? Yepers. Okay. Let's put mm -hmm. some. Sorry, little Rhonda. <laughs> cheddar. 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 Let's Peace get a little cheddar. cheddar on the plate here. We got a little something else there. I don't remember exactly what it was. No, it looks kind of cheddary. Uh, it's kind of yellow. Same family. Yeah, how do you make the pot, the part, pot of starter orange? Oh, well, that was the, that, I, I can tell you that. That was the Infinity. That was the Windsor Newton Infinity. I don't even know that they make this anymore. Like I said, it's old paint Let's from Alaska. Know, guys, if you know. And then? A bunch of other stuff. Yeah, she can tell you. Yeah. I would say, Fran, that the orange that you purchased Here's would be a good starter orange to, like, it was very similar. So if you kind of followed loosely along oh. with how she altered this to make it to cheddar, you would then turn your, um, because what was it, or Azo, what, what did you get, the Amsterdam? Because Fran and I were talking about it. Oh, this. <clears throat> No, she has the... This is very close. No, I know, but she didn't want to get that one. Oh, well, yeah. what did she want to get? Well, the, or they didn't have... She ended up getting the standard. They oh, don't the have, standard's fine. They don't have 218 in standard. Well... They have the Azo, which I think was very close to that Windsor oh. Newton business that you had already in the pot. Now, you see what that just did? Ay, ay, ay. I'm trying to explain things to her. She ain't listening. I, I, I'm thinking about what I'm doing. I'm sorry. That's the way it goes. This is the Mo Betta Cheddar. <laughs> but the right reason I'm doing this is because when I just did that, I was like, whoa, that's really dry. Yeah. Because it got all, like, crusty right away. Well, that's because this Windsor Newton stuff that I put in... All the other stuff in here with is a high pigment paint. Yeah, and Mary Ellen, yes, that's the name that she wrote on there, but there were other things in there, too. That's what I'm uh, trying to, you know, let you guys know that don't be like, oh, once again, here we are. No, that was the original paint that was in here. It, it was just that. Well, I thought you said that you had some red stuff that you needed to mix around more. Well, I did, but it was just on the side. It, it wasn't mixed in with the proper body, and nor was it the swatch here. <laughs> that swatch, that's it. Out of the tube stuff. There you go. Ah, oh, crap. Are you fixing it? Yeah, but I'm messing Oh, you stuck it down in it. Yeah. Oh, Ooh. my goodness, my goodness, all of the trials and tribulations to getting cheddar to make it Maybe that's what we should do call something. Tuesday. Trials and tribulations of Tuesday. Cheddar. Who knew? <laughs> Boom. Oh, there we go. Good. Mo has, she has the Windsor Newton orange and Amsterdam orange. She can compare it. Fantastic. Yes, Mo. We just, I'm curious. So, hmm. you had some leftover something there. Yeah, really. That came off with it. If you get to this soon enough. <laughs> oh, yeah, because it's freezer paper. Freezer paper, you can kind of clean up your mess. <clears throat> well, I'll tell you what, that I don't think that that's going to, I don't think it's going to pull worth a darn. So we might as well just save ourselves a piece of paper and let that dry and we'll come back to it. All right, it sounds lovely. Please use some more impression plates. Please use some more impression plates? Okay. <laughs> we can do that. <laughs> Friends, let's just call this live all about cheddar. <laughs> all about cheddar. And I, I'll put in the different ways to spell it. And the other. <laughs> Mobetta cheddar? Mobetta? Oh. Well, oh, Mo didn't like the Windsor Newton one. I bet you didn't like it because it looks like it dries pretty darn quick. It's kind of like old Lucas. Yeah, before you add enough retarder to make it all right. 
I'll tell you, uh, absolutely. Uh, and, and, and Chalky. Oh, this is a lovely one. Puzzle is a lovely one. Yeah, that's Ma's favorite. I'll put Puzzle out here. That's a good candidate. I like Puzzle. Oh, look, here's, here's the other one, Fran. Yeah. That one I have in the works, Fran. Don't, don't you worry. And here, that, this is a really cute little stencil. I don't know why it's not more popular. It has broken bowls. Yeah, nobody ever orders the broken one. I think I tell you that you have to request it. I do funny things like that. Hmm. I'm not supposed to show that one because they don't like to cut that one. Uh, no, we got it all under control. You do? Yeah, we, we worked out those issues. All right, well, look, then we've got two here. Now, the other thing that I did, who's, who's asking about the impression place? I think that was Angela. Angela? Oh, Mo, this is for you. Oh, yeah, horny man. I have him in multiple forms. Oh, <laughs> he's stuck to which. We also, she has multiple forms, too. She has a bent hat. She has a straight hat. She has a smaller nose. She has a word We're on her nose. trying to build subscribers, yeah. not scare them away. Okay. We will just move right along. <laughs> now, I do have another whole bunch of these in little tiled pieces that I use for um, greeting cards and for cards that we uh -huh. send to you guys. Yeah. Yep. Horny man, big guy. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, that's, I'm not reading that. What? Read it. What, 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 what? Mo says, I'm glad horny man gives you multiples. Oh, this one's a good one too. Oh, goodness. yes. I wait. Show me that one again. I like this one too. Yeah, I static know. orbs. Okay, go back to that other one. That one. Yeah. Okay, that's blip block. Blip block blip rocks. The big one. Lop block. Yeah. Oh, and here, this is Texas. Texas from Texas mm -hmm. that I put multiple ones down, and that made... took some time. Yeah, it did. That, that represents, you know. Oh, and here's Blooms. Eva, look. Uh, yeah. All right, can you stop digging through the box and just start, you know. All right, you got a good okay. bit there. Hey, I finally got my butterfly done. It isn't done like I wanted okay, to Okay, Sharon. Thank you for hanging out with us. She She's leaving. Oh, does she have to go? Yeah. It's late for her. Okay, I lost my plate. What did I do with it? I don't know that... Here it is. I, I don't... May, maybe Ranger has swatch things. Nobody has the fancy ones like gold. The hand done ones. Yeah. That I have... Seen. Well, actually, sorry. That's not true. Because I think if you go to Jackson's, other people do have... But I don't know if they're the hand-painted ones. I didn't confirm that. And, and the reason the hand-painted ones is because you're getting the actual product. Paint. And... Not some printed Golly, representation you know? that you hope that the print operator yeah. really was like knew his bum from a hole in the ground. That's right. He's checking those press sheets to the actual Pantone. Yeah, and we know that how often that happens, uh, and, and probably they're not even well, and if they're printed, printed in the China, United let States. Let me tell you, somewhere <sighs> off in the That's wild, a struggle. wild blue yonder for them to color match. Let me tell you. It's tricky. Tricky. Okay, we have here an opaque. Oh, I love this one too. But I think that these just scream of. Now, you can press lightly or you can press a lot. Depending on what you want to do. But remember, it's best not to do your texture plates double-sided. Yeah. You'll be a lot happier. You won't hurt your hand. Oh, bye, Rhonda. Thank you for hanging out with us. She's got to go do yeah. some yard work. Um, Deb says, uh, is the live? Yes, yeah, all about making a texture plate. Yeah, that probably is the live. That would be. <laughs> Might be it. <laughs> Might be it. Uh... I think yes, that was before you found us, cause that was a that was a while back. Probably 
I mean, I don't think quite a year, but a little while ago, that's for sure. Look at that lovely little impression plate happening. And the cool thing is, is see, you get those. Oh, yeah, and I've already got a plan for this. Now, this one, the first pull. Oh, <laughs> what's her made-up title? Well, it was a really good one, and I might change the. What is it? <laughs> Deb says, uh, she said that was her made-up title. And I'm like, well, that's a that's a very good title. I may need to go back and change our title to that. <laughs> Especially if you guys are searching it. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, Here, I'll do this it. is not so interesting. But <laughs> once I let this dry and I come back and hit it with another color, which hopefully it will dry, but I want to deal with this one right now because this is already dry because it took that, it's that nice chalky kind of. But we're going to amp that up with some... Hmm, I can either go with the orange or I love this cheap paint. Here's salmon. I'm very fond of salmon. Here's hot to trot. <laughs> Is that what it's called? Mm, that's it. <laughs> hot to trot pink. And I think this is almost exactly the same as this one, except this is a little tiny just... bit more orange to it. Mm -hmm. So what are we feeling here? Let me get the print back. What are we thinking? Or... This is my go-to, this. Because what's gonna happen? Where is that pink, it's going to turn sort of purple, but then you're gonna get this nice blue in the sky. Okay, sorry, I'm, I don't know what you, you said there, but. That's what we're gonna do. I'm pretty sure this is the one. Oh, you found it? Mm-hmm. Over there? Is I, there found, a lot? I, I found it over there, but I think I might change it to that title because I really like it. What was the title? <laughs> the Deb came up with all about making a texture plate. Hey. See, sometimes I over, actually yeah. not sometimes, most of the time <laughs> I overcomplicate things. I'm very good at it. I'm almost a master. If they were handing out certificates, I really should get one. She should. <laughs> she gets a gold star in that category. Okay, and if it isn't this one, it's very close in time when we were doing the texture plates and, and focusing on really like, you know, what to do with them. And I believe this was the beginning, so we would have shown probably how to make one. I, I haven't verified yeah. that, but... Chances are. Chances are. And we call them impression plates. We do, because... Technically, that's what you're doing. Yeah, you're making, you're, you're getting a print from an impression from something else. And plus it's a term that not everybody mm -hmm. uses. So when we hear other people call them impression plates, then we know that they've been watching our video. Oh, and bye Natalia, sorry I was looking for... <laughs> Fran oh. said, yeah, it would be great if it was labeled texture plates. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's funny. I'm still wondering about getting shuttle. Yeah, I don't, it, and I'm not sure, like, can you guys get shuttle in the UK? It could just be some weird Amazon. It, yeah, I don't know. Any of those color shift paints in the large sets, I would say that you would be pretty safe, because even um, Lisa, Series Hecka, she ended up getting... She got even more colors than we got in ours, but they were very similar. And really, seriously, I can show you the same. Yeah, even from the folk art, which is more the name brand. Yeah, to the shuttle. To the shuttle. There's, there's not. You get more, actually, that are already kind of mixed up. And the thing about the color shift paints is that you, they're, they're going to be extra tricky to mix them into colors that you specifically want. 
and you know this is this not, is where no. you say okay yeah not worth it <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna try something different here oh here not yet okay because I oh foo 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 poo poo when we were doing the t-shirts one of the things I noticed oh, was... Ricky, yes, we definitely want to know that. She just made a texture plate. She snipped plastic straws into various pieces. Yes, we love seeing that stuff. Love it. Oh, yeah, absolutely. We got a bo That's why I said I was looking through the texture box of her weird little things that she has put together with various things kept that most people throw away. There's slight judgment in that. Yes. I have a very large box full of those things, and I wouldn't let her throw them away. Mm -hmm. I know that she did tote some of them down to the garage. <laughs> I'm aware of that. She doesn't think that I know that, but I do. Look at that. I had a bit of an oopsie squ squishy business. Oopsies, yeah. But, I mean, isn't that just <clears throat> gorgeous? Uh, uh, it weirdly has some dimension to it. It weirdly has some dimension to it. I like that, yeah. Okay, this is yellow, so let's put some... Oh, I love that color. Hi, Diane. Did you sneak this. in on me, or were you here earlier? I thought you were here. Hopefully, we're going to get some of that separation stuff that goes on. I always feel like you're with us, Diane. <laughs> Brayer. Oh, Darcy's giving loves on the orangey-yellow. Oh, burgundy paper would be, yeah. I'm very carefully doing this because I'm not waiting long enough for my paint to dry, <laughs> which is a big no-no, but I think I can do it if I'm very careful. Yeah. Oh, look at that color. Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. Yeah, that's static orbs. Hey, do we want to put it back on here? Why not? Let's do it. Match it up. Oh, I'm not even worried about that. Okay. I think it'll be interesting if it goes someplace else. I'm elephant stomping this, by the way. Well, I think that's some, look at that. Because we're still, it's blocking out some of the other that came through. Uh -huh. Now, if I'd left that on there, all of this would have come off. If I'd let it ripen. But I think that's quite nice. Quite nice. Quite nice. Okay, now what? All right, we're going to fix this one because it's been sitting over here staring at me for weeks. <laughs> Sad little print. That's all sad. <laughs> now I don't know. I think it was homely. <laughs> yes, it is, and it's it just has potential. So I want, I want to make it into something really awesome. And I, I'm what I've got here. I don't think is going to present a problem. The, Sometimes it does. I could change. It's just like the Disney movie with the little girl that's you know got the braces and you know, the bad perm, and then yeah, you know by the end of the movie they've done a little makeover on there. <laughs> this is what I love right here, this green spot. That green spot, I love that green spot. Now the problem is I've got that color of green, but I, it's opaque. But I've got a similar green and non-opaque. I think that that'll do her because I think you'd be surprised in some of those lighter areas, like where the yellowy mm -hmm. tone is. Mm-hmm that you are going to get close to what you got over there, your little happy green spot. <laughs> My happy green spot there? Well, do you think I should go ahead and go with the, um... You know, okay, let's do this. Let's do this, because I want to use this stencil. I really, I love this stencil. And I thought about using that one, and then I said, nah, I think I need the yep, big one. you do. Yep, I yep. need the big one. You do. Oh, that's good. I don't Whatever. think anything's coming off of there. Now, 
I want it down on this end, but I want it to kind of, you know, work itself in. <laughs> what? Die as a shutter, my art teacher used to say. Interesting. Has potential. Now I know it means, geez, that's ugly. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I would get notes from Nathan, my son, Nathan's teacher, that said he was very social. It meant he never shut up. Yeah. And was removed from the classroom on numerous occasions because he was unable to shut his mouth. Yeah. And that's kind of still the case. Yes. Fran's on board with I'd like to make happy green. <laughs> happy green. I know. Isn't this a wonderful green? I like that green. I worked long and hard on that green. Mm-hmm. That was not an easy... What if it turns out that that's goose poop? <laughs> you had made it all along. I made it all along. <laughs> now, I think... Goose poop more, leans more towards um, like a, this with spots of yellow in it. For, well, I, you know. I I don't think that. Or are we gonna make it spotty? I don't know. Mm. Now I'm gonna brayer as much of this off as I possibly can. Yes, it's the patina green, also agave like. Yeah, it very much is, and I was inspired by you know, Seth stuff. And I have been saving um, tissue papers for you all. I have a stack, and I, I'm going to start putting those in order, like the bigger ones. So, do let me know. If you really are interested, I will send you even more. I feel kind of bad. Like, I mean, I don't want to send you things that you guys don't want. Yeah. <laughs> but we we like for them. our stuff to have a happy home. Even, I mean, the and the thing is, is like these tissue papers are, 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 should be the start to something. Like, you should take them and print over them and do things with them. They are not. And muss them about. Yes. There, that's it. Muss them about. Muss them about. I think this might be pretty darn good, but I, I'm hoping it shows up because your, your green may be well, a little more not. Well, it's not going to show. I wanted it to show up more than it did, yeah. but it at least... I can come back in now. Yes. What? Be sure to send all the things, yes. Be sure to send all the things. Who said that? Deb, she says, I will write on there. Send all the things. Love, Deb. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey. I like that, though. And, and even though it's not as dark as the your happy green spot, it, it's enough that you're getting there. You need to obliterate the blue in the corner. That's the main well, problem. Well, here, let me show you how I'm going to do that. You're going to, yeah, you need to, you need to, <laughs> but, or just remove it. There's more than one way to skin a cat. That's right. Sometimes just a little clippy clippy and snippy snippy. There we go. There you go. I still think the blue needs a little. Can you can you finger buff on some paint there and just get rid of that blue? I don't like the blue down there. Oh, okay. Well, then I think it's beautiful and wonderful. What's next? Okay, I think that that's good. Well, let's see. What did I have queued up here? Oh, did you see how Lee Leanne? Created a wonderful eye with her mandala stencil. It was on her challenge piece. Well, I need to go back and look at that more detail. Mm -hmm. Oh, I haven't been. I I just this week's was been a little weird. Quickly on oh, and off, but week I had to did. get ready for this. This you know the thing that we're doing right now. Thing we're doing right now. See, Mo studies things. She she is the I know it. Seeing <laughs> Mo so. Like, and I appreciate that because then it makes me go, okay, I need to look at this even with... Isn't that a beautiful... Like, through the eyes of Mo. That that should be the way. Through the eyes of Mo. And look at the, the this. Isn't this lovely? I'm putting this aside now and that's going to become a... Oh, I like that. Yeah. A print. I, I really like it. I just throw those on the floor until I get ready to get up. Okay, now, <clears throat> I got this mucky muck going on here. A little bit. And I don't <clears throat> know that I want to do anything with that. <coughs> Pardon me. I know. There's something. Mine was scratchy. I have tea. Now, I don't... Is that my 6x8? My 6x8. Oh, you're getting some love on that one. It was gorgeous. Beautiful. Frame that one. 
it. I'm getting ready to mess it up. No, they're tight. See, she's like, mm. no, the one that you trim the edges. Oh, yeah. I don't know, just threw it over there. I don't know what I did, what I did with it. We need a mess about session. I thought that's kind of what all of this was, Susan. <laughs> that is. Isn't it that really nice? Is. I just, I think it needs some gold, though, honestly. Oh, yes. Can you do that? Let's play with that. Let's make it gold. Well, you know I'm on board with that. You want me to flex something on there? I, guess I don't a, think so. That's a no. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay. Gold it is. Now, here's the whole thing with gold. Move quickly. Oh, I swear. I, was, I, mean, I need some of this in open, Mariah. Do they make this in open? I think so. Maybe. I'll look. Well, I'm just going to open it up myself. But a lot of times when you add that sort of stuff to the shimmery things, they I become know. a little less shimmery. That's true. FYI. But as soon as I get my glossy yes. retarder, uh, well, no, it's things may change. I keep trying to explain to her that it's not glossy retarder. Yes, it's, it is. It's glossy medium that may. I was anyway. I, I I'm I'm looking for glossy retarder. I know. Please let me know if you guys come across anything that actually says glossy retardant. And remember, you want to get all of that off of the surface there because remember, it will leave a hole. Yeah. A, a, a blobby lob. And I don't think I've added enough that I have destroyed my gold. Probably. Diane says add a few drops of flow medium. Flow without the mat. See, she knows these things. Flow without the mat. So drops of flow medium. Do you have a brand that you recommend? Or just flow troll? Are you just trying to get me to say things, Diane? <laughs> <laughs> I think she is. I think she is. I think it might be the I, I asked for a brand. Maybe that is it. I don't know. It sounds like one of Izzy's characters from one of those weird movies or shows that she watches. It's flow troll. <laughs> okay, now I probably should pull this as a ghost print, but I'm going to from try the something. the hardware store. Because <laughs> I'm hoping that this is going to be... I would just put in portcullis. <sighs> I've been working on that. I still don't think that's right, though. Okay, that look at beautiful. that. beautiful, yes. That's wonderful. Yeah, and maybe I can actually get something off of this that would make something else happy. <laughs> Fran just put it in too. I see. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, it's used in the acrylic pouring and is really great. Well, you probably could just put in a few little drops of that thick stuff that you got that it really technically isn't thick because it sounds like this might be like pretty much what this stuff is anyway. It is using acrylic pouring and it is really great. Yes, it is used to add into house paint as a retardant. Can you see it? Yes. Well, sort of. Oh, come on. Oh, yes. There. Tur there. Now you guys can see it. Look at that. It's showy yet subtle. It's subtle. Yes. Subtle. And I'm loving this now. Look at that. Love it. Love it. Love it. Okay. okay. Well, I'm going to have to look that up. All right. Look at us learning things. Okay. I've got some gold here I need to use. <clears throat> well, that's going to be kind of gold on gold. Yeah. Probably. You need to choose a different one. Yeah, I need to choose a different one. Mm -hmm. But see that just that little bit of retardant with that gold it's not changing the gold all that much but boy is it giving me a lot more you know downtime yada yada i need to have things lined up here and i really don't but let's see about this there you go violet has a gallon of it she used it for her paint pours oh 
I don't know that I want to do that. You need to make a decision on something. I'm saying. I know. And I don't, I've got papers, but I don't have the right ones. and never have the right ones, Mariah. And then she just makes more. <laughs> I like that. I think that's a... That was a good choice. Yeah. Well, that was a fly by the seat of your pants. Decision. I don't know, but the lighting just got amazing. I know. I think this happen every day. Fingers crossed, summertime will bring us lots of this lovely lighting. It's one of the reasons I like the 3 p.m. idea because we have always said 3 p.m. is the greatest lighting up here. Now you kind of lollygagged about. Lolly right. gagged about. Hey, but we got some. There's some there. There's some there. Some there. Oh, Gail said she she bought half a quart of it. Got tired of doing the paint pouring, really quick, <laughs> and she has half a bottle left. and said, make decisions. Woman, I need to get to work soon. <laughs> <laughs> okay, moving right along here. Oh, goodness. Uh, there's still some more stuff out there. Oh, my gosh, here's my other stencil. I kept thinking that I, I lost it, but hmm. I didn't. Here's my other. What, I don't know what we call these. The little lacy ones. Tracery and then the <laughs> Celtic. Well, Celtic's married up with tracery here. I know. In a very delicate position. I don't know if I'm going to... Oh, there you there. go. There we go. All right. So, I have... I don't think you've ever actually used the Celtic live. I mean, you used it in the background, but... Well, I cut out the outside I part because I didn't like it. I thought it was fussy. Or chunky. You slimmed her up. Yeah. I just didn't like that outside business. It was, well, I thought, thought it, well, and if you want to do that when you buy yours, you can. You have my permission. Uh-oh. Yeah, I wouldn't use, yeah, okay, so, um, Google says you can use the watered-down Elmer's glue as a substitute for Floetrol. Diane says, no, 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 don't use the glue on paint poles. I would have to agree with that. Like, you could substitute that, like, for paint that you're putting on your walls, but probably not a great thing for paint pools. Gel plate. Yeah. I, I'm very cautious about what I use. And then I would say, um, yeah. Oh, needs. that's got a little bit. That's not going to make that much difference. And then, um, tar gel is glossy retarder. I, I think so. Diane. Diane knows these things. I keep referring to her because I feel like she knows. Well, or she, she owned she the store it, with all that stuff yeah. in it. I mean, we just... And talk to, like, people that, you know, the... the that actually vendors used Vendors and it. salespeople. We just... You know, buy some things and... Buy some things and muss about. <laughs> muss about. Mostly muss about. Yes. All righty. So... I know I want to maintain a lot of this, but I don't... I never liked the position, like, that you got I, well, rid see, of some of the spinners. And... I know, and and I don't, I'm not sure why that happened. Mo Take likes to... this one, doesn't want you to do anything with it. Why don't you just put it in a pile and send it to Mo? Mo, you're going to like it more better when I get done. She's going to do something to it. Might not be the right thing to do, but I am going to do it. Oh, my goodness. Did you see that little booger just bounce off there like a Mexican jumping, jumping bean. bean? Holy moly. Sometimes I can guess what she's going to say. I've known her for a while. <laughs> Most of my life. There, there was a period I didn't feel like I knew her. <laughs> oh, likewise. <laughs> there was. It was a common, like, who I, are you? And, I, put her, I put her name in a box and <laughs> turned her over to the higher powers because it was like, yeah, well, I don't know. Oh, goodness. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh. You, you say talk, they say stock. <laughs> 
We love you down here. It was the paint saying no. <laughs> That's what I was saying. She's, she's not recognizing the, the, the universe giving her signs. Yeah, I, I don't know that I agree with this, but she's doing it. It said, hi, I want to visit my booger family. <laughs> Do you feel good about this decision? What? Do you feel good about this? Not necessarily, but, um... Not a lot came off. That was a good... I think the universe has told her that she <laughs> needs to leave it the... <laughs> it rejected it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, that's, that's good. All signs are pointing to leave it alone. <laughs> Here, let's mess this one up. I don't know that you got anything on... I, like, I think it's dry. Although that was paint on paint. Paint on paint. Well, you got some paint on paint there, but less paint. Oh, goodness. Hey, you know, you just, sometimes you just got to go with it, right? I was laughing. And Lisa's, or uh, Leanne's laughing. Everything too. came off. Okay. It was meant for that one. I like that. I think that's pretty cool. I think it's extremely cool. Let's see if we can do that with this one. Okay. What are we going to use? Same thing? I like the little, and you've got a bit of it still left on there. I see it. But I think for this one, you should put it on your print where you want it and do that, you know, picking up business. Well, I'll tell you what, that little bit of retarder, mm -hmm. I'm still getting gold. Wow. Well, the gold keeps giving. Yeah. That looks pretty close, right? Okay, take us to the shower. And what color did we use? Take me to the river. <laughs> this, I but I am thinking more of this. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. I love that combo. I do too. It's gonna it's gonna muck about with the tomato. Yes, thank goodness. Something needs to be toned down with that murdery business. It's that's tomato. Who doesn't like that color? It's just it's a it's lot. Very just... festive. Mm-hmm. Come festive. on now, people. Give her some party give, lights and give her, pinatas. give her some, you know, some buses with the dangly bits. She's going on a party van. <laughs> no comment. No comment. Francis, purple it. Oh, that would be good too. Maybe even put some purple with it too. Put it in the right spot. Oh, sugars. It's all right. We can cut that off. Was that where you wanted it? Kind of. You know, on the butterfly's body? Um, Where'd you want it? Up there in the space that would make sense. No. I wanted it where the butterfly, it looked like it was I, interfering with I his think body. I this is like playing pool. You didn't really call your shot, and I don't believe that you called the pocket that you ended up in. I did, because look how <laughs> it beautifully goes right there where the circular part of the butterfly well, is. Well, can you bring it back in? We'd oh, all sorry. like to see that. <laughs> I was showing you, Mariah. Just being rude. What do you guys think? I think it would have been nicer up in the sky there where the little butterfly was headed. To go into the, you know, Celtic Oh my sun. goodness, look what's happening again. Oh, she's getting the weird... It, 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 oh, I, I'm still like really zoomed in. I can zoom out. Or do you guys like being zoomed in? Check this out. This is so cool. Let me zoom out so you can see her. Oh, there you go. Oh. This is that same brayer. It's weird things happen. That looks cool though. Doesn't it look cool? Oh, yeah. and I mean, just, just every now and then, it just decides to give it up. But I'll tell you what, I'm saving that because that's absolutely stunning. <laughs> these stunning! Cookie brayer rolls. Brayer rolls. Yeah, I, I think, love the color combo. I think this is really nice. This is an area where you rest your eye, Mariah. 
Hey, justification. All, all of the, all just as of important the, as rustification. Yeah, and, and there's, you know, everybody likes. I'm not even gonna. <laughs> Francis, say. that's weird. I love it. I think she's talking about the weird Brayer roll stuff. Oh, I know. Yeah. Yeah, that's some. That's some stuff. Epic. Of epic. Okay, Fran wants purple. Fran, I have a purple for you that will blow your uh, mind. I, okay. Oh, can, can you reproduce that business that you did with, um, I think it was a Jelly Shelly print. Or no, it was with the new Bloopy Loops. With Because I, I asked her, is that black? This is her purple. It is quite huh. stellar. I'm, I'm going to um, do it on here and it's not going to be the same. Okay. But, Kind of, sort of. Now, I would say what would be really cool is if you could mix the purple and the gold. Or is that what you were already thinking? But now you're no. mad that I said that, and so now I, you're not. No, I do was it. not thinking. I, I was <laughs> not. Because that was sort of that look. Like. God, you are just on a. I don't know. I'm all... Rip ass <laughs> terror today. <laughs> okay. Oh. See, you used it on there. That's the same one. I love the bloopy loops. Now remember. Those no, old. I want to put down the paint, pull yeah. it up. Yeah. Because I want linear. I do not want bloppies. Yeah, and here, do you want to try to layer? Oh, this chair popping business. I got to get under here. And yeah, give, that give, out. give me some, some tissue paper. Now, are you good with Honey some? bunny. I don't care what it is. We're just going to send here. it to somebody anyway. Well, I know, but it'll be cool layered up. Huh. Are you good with that, is what I'm saying. Yeah, okay. I'm good. Oh, it might help if I brayered this out. I'm going to try to give you some of this, you know, not got a lot of stuff on it. So yeah, because it doesn't pick up if you have paint on it. Yeah. Your tissue paper doesn't pick okay. up. Okay, those are two good ones, I think. I think you're absolutely what you're right. This is some mighty fine purple, friend. And I do have, I do have, um, see, look at what that's doing. The brayer is leaving funky weirdnesses on the gel plate, but we don't really care. It doesn't matter. Yeah, Moe's digging this, too. Yeah, this is totally in Moe's wheelhouse of color love. On this one, you've got to really push in those little places where it joins up. The smaller loops. Because otherwise it, it, it stays there. And it looks kind of cool because it makes it almost like a three-dimensional shading effect. Mm -hmm. Okay, I think that's probably good. I'm really pushing this down so I can imprint that stencil into... Squish paint. that paint around. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Oh, Fran's giving you purple hearts. Lots of them. Nicely done, lady. Layers, layers, layers. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. And I like this piece of tissue paper. <laughs> I'm not giving you this back. I'm keeping this one. So this is going to go on old red once she gets her layer of gesso. Oh, thumbsy upsies, hearts. Rustification. Purple heart. Lots of love there, P. I uh, know. I'm telling you, this purple. Yeah. And I do not. I just know that it was a bunch of tubes of paint that had, you know, about this much in them. And I had to really push on them. To, and one of those kind of lids that hurts my fingers to get it off. I thought, I am going to just put them all together. And this is it. And, of course, it's absolutely the most fabulous purple ever. 
Now I don't know how to make it. <laughs> oh, Kelly, thank you. Oh, she, well. She, she's getting us note up on Tulip brand fabric paint. We just didn't want to buy any more paint. And we figured that, you know, P keeps getting this stuff on her shirt and it doesn't come out. So we were going to be all right. So far, so good with the paint on the shirts. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -oh. But she, she says they have one that's called So Soft. That's amazing. I, it tries I, in 24 hours and no heat setting needed. I, I don't know what this is going to do, but I'm just feeling like Hi, it's Maggie. going to be interesting. This mix of purple and oh whatever that. Yeah, that is. This is why I love the gel plate because it's like. Will you ever be able to get that again? Ever? Probably not. The answer is nope. But maybe. Close. <laughs> Maggie, have you used your tracery? Because you have the tracery stencils. She loves those colors. I'll send you some prints. <laughs> Look at that. Awesome stuff. Oh, that's interesting. Mary Ellen says, uh, Floetrol is an additive used to improve the workability of paint and coatings. It is a water-based product that helps reduce brush and roller marks and makes the paint easier. Makes it more flow. And probably evens out. Because then that's how you, you get rid of the brush strokes. It evens out quicker as it dries. Okay. Well, that's good to know. I don't know that that's information that I necessarily need at this point in my life, but you never know. <laughs> you just never know. Hey, you know what? Information ain't heavy. It isn't. And I don't need that information right now, but you know. I uh, like it. I, who knows for the future. Oh, look at that nice mucky muck there. Normally that's my job to remember these sorts of things. <laughs> she just kind of mixes things together like a mad sign. Like the, you know, Swedish chef from the Muppets. <laughs> How'd you make that? No idea. I used to, I used to do it in the... <laughs> I used to do it in the ceramics lab and it just drove them all crazy. Oh, goodness. Yeah. Now, I'm giving this a little bit of a mix here. Just simply because... Oh, yes. Heather said it looked like spilled coffee. Yeah. Like you had your blueberry scone out there and <laughs> trying to dab it up and clean up. <laughs> Maybe the goose had been in the blueberry patch. <laughs> the goose has been eating the blueberries. Oh, well, there you go, Pink. Yeah, because Pink is a poor. She does beautiful poor stuff. Beaker. No, Beaker's the... Beep, 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 beep. He's that one. No, the Swedish chef. You know? Her, da, da. That one. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to really get if you want to really get her laughing, just, you know, sing her the Bonnie Foo Foo song. Oh, my gosh. That's she just, just cracks up every time. I just wish I knew the rest of it. I just know the main verse. Well, we looked it up that one time. I don't remember it. No, animal's different. <laughs> Bor yeah. Yeah. That one. Born good to born. And the yip yips. Pink is going to try the, the, the flow troll stuff and let us know how all that goes. Yes, coffee and blueberry muffins. Yeah, come for the art. The <laughs> imitations and comedy is a bonus. <laughs> Always said that that part's free. So the other part, but you know. <laughs> oh, goodness. I'm registering. She's <laughs> that's why you see the top of her hat. Like well, a magic I'm, thing. She's not really going to show you how she does it because it's, it's very it's top <laughs> secret. Basically, so she can see it and get gets registered. Gets registered. Mm -hmm. Y'all registering that? Registering that? That doesn't get old. This is this is 
<laughs> this is as close to anything lined up lined up as I'm gonna get or that I care to get well you dirty bugger Oh, that's sweet. When Leanne was a kid, her, her dad um, gave the whole family nicknames from the Muppets. From what? From the Muppets. Oh. oh, really? Okay, this isn't coming up, but you know what? That's all right. I can figure out how to do it. With a little quinacridone, nickel, mm -hmm. azo, gold. No? I don't think that you're going to see as much as you want to see from it. So I think you need to go with the more yellowy one. Or, um, Indian? Yes. Okay. Yeah. I'll do that just because I don't really have a druther. That's fantastic. In my... Now, what would be really great is if you can then put it back onto that print that you got. Well, that's exactly oh, what okay. I had in mind. I didn't know that that Honey was... Honey bunny. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm glad I... Asking that. You to call your shots. I am so glad I brayered off my brayer because it was like mud. Violet oxide. I I know. Whoever said that, yes. Who do you I have, think that I was? I have it coming. Fran, it is coming. <laughs> I have bitched and moaned about it long enough that I think it actually is it going is. to it happen. It should be here Friday. Okay, now, here I go with my spatially retardedness. Is that how it goes? Uh, yes, that looks about right. Oh, yeah, buddy. Well, I'm pretty jazzed about that. Gotta be quick, friend. Gotta be quick. There's a lag and she moves quick. <laughs> you got to or your paint dry, sweetheart. <clears throat> oh, ho, ho. Now, how about that for some rustification? Hi, yi, yi. Boy. Get along, Steam little doggies. Line up. <laughs> Look at that area right there. Is that not just absolutely, I mean, couldn't you just wet yourself over that one? Fran, I'll send that one to you with the, with the swatchies. Yeah. All right, let's get this guy back on here and see if we can cause something to happen to the white. You're getting lots of love on that one. The white is just not making me very happy, and I don't really know. Now, here's a, here, I got okay. an idea. All right, I'll listen to it. I might not I do it. I know. So what I really would love for you to do is possibly your crazy purple. We're calling it crazy purple because she was crazy and mixed a bunch of things together, and nobody really knows. A purple never to be repeated purple. No. Yeah. But okay. if you put it down, or... or Get get that on your plate. Put the stencil down, same one. Then line your stencil up over on that print and brayer it on there. Boy, you don't ask for much, do you? That's going to require a lot of very precise placement. I feel like I could do it. Would you, you like to come over here? Are you going to move your... Can, can, can this easily be done in the next 10 minutes? <laughs> oh, I think so. I, I'm probably not going to do it exactly like you want me to do it, but I think I can accomplish something of similar. Okay. But my problem is, if I'm putting the paint on here... Mm -hmm. Really, you're just kind of like how Carrie did. How he had... Remember how he was taking his stencils and then... Putting them down and rolling. Yeah, but... Now, come on. To line it up? Yeah. I'll tell you what. I will come over... Or if you hand it to me... All right, give me the print. Give me the print. I don't want to do that. I want to do it another way. I okay. don't want to do that. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I don't think that that is Hello, the Curly thing D. to do. <laughs> Hello, Journey. <laughs> <clears throat> See, Deb even said, if anyone can do it, you can, Miss Sweet Pea. You know, what she's asking me to do, she's asking me to take this and flip it and match it up over there. Whilst it's all oopy goopy with paint. Ah, just the one end, because you're going to hang it off. You, you don't have to get it all. Yeah, but it's going to go over here and, and mess up my margin. We're worried about the margin. 
Well, I am right now. <laughs> it's nice and clean. It doesn't have any paint there. Now, All right, here, hold on. So, talking about this other one over here, it's already got a big old smear on it. All right, well, they, they got real excited about the naughty smile you said when, whenever you, you want to come over here and do that. I may just do it. Uh, put the purple down, put the stencil down with white tissue, remove stencil, put plate on that print. There you go. That I can do. Fran called it. That I can do. Mar see, Deb, C Deb C says that margin overprints are beautiful. I agree. And, and it's seriously like, I mean. What is that? Yeah. Oh, Marcy says mask the border with some washi. Yeah, I know. Um, we could do that. I like that idea. This is my, my brayer that has funky stuff on it. Y'all, that's what's happening here. The funky town. Remember when it, I had all that really great stuff going off on the it's still brayer looking. off? Well, we're still dealing with that. It's still giving. It's giving. <laughs> okay, now, here's the here's the problem. Oh, How do I... Journey was, she was lurking. She said that, that print drug her down from the bleachers. <laughs> I like that. All right, all right. I think even if you're off, it it, it, it will be all right. Yeah, there you go. Because your paint was down. Yeah, there you go. That's close enough. I, I don't think you have to be spot on by any means. Okay. She'll be interesting. Ooh. Now, yeah, get that. We've obliterated my beautiful background. You did. That you did. So the least we can do is at least get some fucking yeah. purple on that. Sometimes. Uh, Diane says the register hat. <laughs> Things are being registered when the hat is, is in, in shop. Yes. I think it's beautiful. And I don't, I don't even, hate it. I don't even mind that the, the beautiful stuff in the background did get obliterated. But you have that on the other one. So, you know, keep them as a set. There you go. <laughs> see, see, this is really beautiful brown mm -hmm. stuff. Here. Well, that's what that used to be. Now, if, you give me, if you give me that other one. And I can spray it. I can make it look like that other one. I might do that. She's not going to let me do it now. Maybe oh. we do that on Thursday. Thursday thoughts. Oh, yeah. man, I've got some good thoughts for Thursday, y'all. Yes, you do. I, I wrote them down. Mm -hmm. They are on. They're in a... We'll be able to find them. They're in my large sketchbook. Fran said you forgot the tissue. Damn it, Fran, you're right. <laughs> That's how you got screwed up. <laughs> Where are you? Where are you when I need you? We need you in the other room. We need you live. <laughs> Hello, Nisi. Oh, goodness. That was such a rookie move. I, I still think it's quite lovely. I would have liked it better. Oh, and Diane would like to know what shade is frickin'. Is it opaque or transparent? <laughs> uh, this is pretty opaque. Yeah. I, I wanted to put an O on the bottom, but I wouldn't be able to see it anyway. So I just have well, to rely know, we, on that. We've got... Here, here, hand it over. Well, I think I can look at the thing on the top. It's not like, you know, oh. rocket science. Well, I mean, I didn't want to mess up your hole. Yeah, I know. I'm pretty proud of old cheddar. Yes. It's got a recap here. Why don't you spread out some of those prints from, okay. from let me, let me get rid the Yes. And I'll do the spiel. Uh, we are getting very close to 3,000 subscribers, y'all. I've even started, you know, copying down all the names. 
do go back to you know sun, the Sunday streams if you have it. You still have the opportunity to put your name in. If you are outside of the United States of America, please let me know. It makes it a little easier for me. A lot of you guys I kind of know, but I may not know that you are not here in the States. So if you end up like when we do the giveaway wheel, yeah, you should do some purple on that. I agree with that thought. Whatever it was that you were having over there, I agree with it. Um, do let me know that you're outside the United States. Um, so that way, but if, yes, if we do the wheel and we're still doing the drawing, then I'm just going to consider it, you know, the, the outside the United States one. Maybe. I don't know. I don't worry about that the day of. These are the thoughts I have. Please do give this video a thumbs up. Please like, subscribe, and do all that business that, you know, one does on YouTube. If you aren't already subscribed to the channel. I think a lot of you, most of you that are in the chat have. Um, but those of you that are kind of popping in and lurking no. and watching replays and such, no. please do. We love comments. Let us know. And, uh, you know, let us know what you liked about this, this particular live stream. If you are placing orders... Do let us know that you want some prints or some tissue paper, you know, business. If you want innards. And if you want innards or outers, I mean, innies and outies. You know, each thing has its own pieces and parts that are worthy of I'll send sending that one along. to Mo. We have a little ding-dong ding here. <laughs> Just little. rub a little pigeon poop on it and it'll be fine. Yeah, so uh, come back and let us know in the comments if you're interested in, you know, us mixing other paints. I think this still need. look at yeah. this, you know what this needs? Look, this is what this needs. Oh, yeah, with some And use purple. some dead gum tissue paper to get rid of the excess. Yeah, the, the frickin' purple. Frickin' purple. <laughs> and I think this is very oh, nice. Goodness. I'm not sure. If, I just need something. I don't know what it, it oh, needs. Oh, hey. And this Saturday, remember, it's the Maker's Creative Club, Let It Rain. I have seen quite a few of some, you know, the peop the YouTubers. And, hey, Mo, it's on. Non-YouTubers. Yeah. I know. I got, I've got. i got to finish mine. Mm-hmm. But uh, non-YouTubers, please be posting your stuff in Maker's. There have been some great ones. Oh, John Davids was hilarious and lovely and wonderful. And then Mo even pointed out things that I didn't notice. And I love that. Some pink stuff. Man, you did a lot of prints today. Yeah. I like that one. I think this still needs something. It needs something of definition. It might need... <laughs> Carolyn says, Miss Pete, I left a murdery photo in Makers because... That word just needed to be honored. <laughs> I like me yeah. some murdery red. Mariah's always on me about. Yeah, it looks just, you know. Murdering up my blue. red. There's a nice little butterfly on a diagonal. I don't know. I could have done better with that. Oh, Kelly, she says Thursday is open studio day at the art school. Oh, that's kind of nice. I wonder if they have that here. So she does. So she misses the live on Thursdays. But she goes to the school and does thing at the school. That's kind of nice. I know. I wish they would do that. That art programs here. And it isn't true all over Texas. You know, I taught for 24 years in a tiny little town. Of course, I was the art department. But um, we had a, a good department. Oh, Sandy posted hers today. Pardon? Sandy posted hers today. Oh, she did. Oh, I, I know she did. I saw it already. I commented on it. it was a It was beautiful. Did I miss it? I've been kind of in and out all day, so. It it was um, real flowers Ooh. and stencils, and I think some of our stencils were in the background, maybe. Nice. Look at this. I mean, you, there's some iridescent qualities there that are quite stunning. All right. We we are at the end of the stream. Um, I'm at the end of all of the stuff I did today, other than my brayer they... offs. If you want to see those, I've got those also. But... And stay here. And you didn't even leave anything on the plate for us to do. Like, quick. I still have some shorts from Sunday that need to go up. So 
Keep an eye out for those. No, I just have mucky plates that need, you know, to be. We never did pull old. Yeah, the first one that with oh, the weird webby. stuff yeah, that the... came off. I think we need to do more with impression plates. I, I, I always enjoy the impression plate. Maybe show, like, how we... We should make some new impression plates because there have been new stencils. I know, but I just get really bored with that. It's just so, you know, <laughs> mundane and oh, pedestrian. He, he it's just, not very exciting. I, well, then that's your job to pep it up there, P. <laughs> I'll talk about that. I'm going to put some purple on this bugger. Oh, goodness. Do you guys but want I'm, to stay and watch this? I'm not I'm not sure that I... This <laughs> Don't is, leave yet, Leslie. <laughs> this, I'm not sure. This I haven't is, turned it off. Stencil that I need. <laughs> she's she's going to put some purple down. Or I might leave I'm, you guys hanging. I'm going to burple you. Oh, it has snowed so much. In the last two hours, it looks like December outside where Carolyn's at. That's so nutty. That's some crazy stuff. I don't know if I've got enough of that on there to hold it, but we shall see. All right. We shall see. And don't forget the tissue. Don't forget the tissue. Don't forget the tissue. I can't believe I did that. I mean, I know I'm just keep harping on that, but... That was just a rookie move. I was wondering what, but you, you were so, you know. You, you need to reach across and smack me with something when I'm on that, you know. Uh-huh. Yeah. I will next time. You can borrow that stick that I used downstairs oh. to point to your I might bring theater. a stick up here. <laughs> Start poking at her. Nah, eh, 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 eh. No, no, no. Did you forget something? Put the tissue on a stick. So you can grab it <laughs> like this. You know how they feed sharks and stuff. <laughs> well, it's not really mussing about over there. It's I not think... very gushy. I'm going to gushy it up a little bit. Yeah? Mm hmm Okay. Well, I didn't mean that last little... <laughs> Yes, exactly, Kelly. Oh, Susan says, P, don't, it's okay. Don't be hard on yourself. You're amazing. We love you. Oh, well, thank you. Just like, I, if I'm showing people how to do things, I think it would be really important if I kind of knew how I was doing things. And, well, I mean, that, is, that, that, is, that purple is almost black. Oh, Mo is loving the purple with cheddar. It's one of my favorite rusty combos. Yes. Oh, and no. then Susan, uh, or Carolyn says, Mo, that sounds like a cheese sandwich with grape jelly. <laughs> oh, well, I like eggs and grape jelly. Yeah, I do like, I eat, you know, light on the egg, but yes. Now, I want to be careful because I'll be pulling up my cheddar. Oh. Do not want to pull up my cheddar. See, that's what Mo was talking about because that does create the rustification. That's pretty. We've still got a little bit more to go. We're just going to go with old Butterfly here, who really, you know, he's not doing too terribly much anyway. <laughs> oh, it says, but I am British. We don't do orange cheddar and grape jelly in a sandwich. <laughs> just not as posh as the cucumber ones. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, I'm just wondering about this cucumber sandwich, you know? It doesn't have mayo. Like, is there a dressing or, or that, that's my question. And I want to know how, how do you slice your cucumbers? Are they thickly sliced? Are they thinly sliced and they're the, layered? And yeah, and is it going to make the bread all mooky? Mooky. Are they going to slip out when you bite them? Orange cheddar here is red lice, lice, Lysis, L E I C E. Lyster. Lyster? I think. Ha! Look at that! Sports fan. I like grape jelly. I do. I'll tell you what. I like grape jam. If you've ever made grape jelly, you will appreciate 
it is very difficult. It takes a lot of time because you have to take the seeds out, you have to take the skins off, you got to smoosh it through this thing that goes like this. It, it, oh man. I used to hide it because I, it was so valuable that I didn't want anybody to eat it and, that didn't appreciate it. Didn't get it Ow. out when certain people came. Because they were stupid. Look at that. Like Lester? <laughs> Leicester. Leicester. I think it's Leicester. Might want me to say it again. And then Francis, Red Leicester. I want to say it like Leicester. Leicester, sir. Leicester, sir? Leicester, sir. That's really what I want to say. And Worcester beetroot. Sure. Oh, they put mayo. Mayo or cream cheese and sliced cucumbers. Well, maybe mayo. I do that, like some cream cheese, though. Yeah, that cream know. cheese would keep that cucumber from slippy sliding around, too, because if you yeah, smash it down. Yeah, you want it, it on down, both sides of the bread, I think. Yeah, part. you could, like, yeah, yeah, capture it. See, you hang out to the very end and get five minutes of food talk. <laughs> oh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, Brenda, that's awesome. She says, I, I love those doily mandalas. I love, love, love them. She has them. And she loves them. Pronounce Lester. Okay. Lester. Lester like Fester. <laughs> Lester like know. Fester. Good one. Yeah. Oh, you. proper cucumber sandwich is no cream cheese, no mayo. Dry? Mm -mm. I'm out. But what kind of bread do you use? And is it just cucumbers? I mean, I love a veggie sandwich. Is it, is it, like, is it like cucumbers with just raw cucumbers or have they been pickled <laughs> this is food talk plus how to pronounce random cities in England <laughs> yeah come here for all kinds of yeah. stuff okay is that a leave it and pull it it's a it's it's a ripen okay see that'll be Sorry. a nice that'll be a nice little short but for y'all did y'all see how beautiful it is I'm loving it see that's what she meant to do on that other one tis mm-hmm and it's like I, I know how to do it. I just didn't do it. Raw cucumber with heart, hardly any flavor. Wow. Oh, you have to cut the crust off. Yeah, that, that I know because it always looks so pretty. But I don't know. And they probably have to, you have to consume them rather rapidly or the bread soaks up the cucumber mm -hmm. and then you have a soggy, mushy mess and that wouldn't be very attractive. Mm -hmm. and it would be hard to eat. You might have to. Yeah, now I'm hungry. Use your cutlery to, mm -hmm. so like swallowing slugs or something. Now I'm not hungry. All right, guys, that was really awesome. If you're kind of catching us here at the very end, this is the end. The end. The end. Of it the is stream. really, really the end. We do appreciate you popping in, but do come back, rewatch, leave us comments in the comments section. You know the ones below, not in the chat, because we're about to end all of that. <laughs> Izzy would be proud of you, Ryan. I know. I love being Rhymey. And um, let's see. Like, subscribe, do all that business. Makers of Mixed Media Art and Artist Facebook group. If you want to hang out with us during the week and in between and interact with lots of these lovely folks that are in the chat, they are also hanging out over there and posting the things that they make. They which are. we love and experiment. And it just makes us, mm, warms my heart. Um... That information is all in the description box below. You hit the little show me more. There's a lot more information more than you ever want to know, including some of the affiliate links, like to the papers and things that we like. And then if you want to go over to our website, there's a blog there, lots of information. Um, that is also where you can purchase a lot of these stencils that you see. And yes, we are going to let it rain. Let it rain this week. Um, I'm very excited about mine. I'm bringing it, Mo. I'm just letting you know. The rain has been brought in. <laughs> um, I'm still working on mine, and it's less than stellar right now. But I feel sure that, you know, it'll... It might be a Friday post. <laughs> Maybe sa Saturday early Well, you morning. told me I had all week. Yeah, it's Tuesday. I just have to do it before Saturday. Basically, Tuesday's over, so you have Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Oh. Yeah. Well, Maybe what we could do, I have some new stencils that will be going in as well. Some raindroppy ones. And maybe for Thursday. You never did make me that 
the paisley raindrops oh like sharon has yeah yeah well it's because it takes forever and we've been running that machine for you know days about days so there you go um i guess i won't be getting that one i've got one over here i found my other i found my other rain God, can we end a stream for the love of god <laughs> we'll see you guys over at makers bye bye we'll see you on thursday <laughs> bye continue this on thursday that's right